Hello, Jonathan Bradshaw here with a Meteorology Minute inspired by my recent trips to speak on meteorology in Russia and the Republic of Ireland. Let me explain. On both occasions, I've driven back from the airport past a huge new housing development not far from where I live. When I landed from Moscow two weeks ago, I vividly remember the huge sign promoting the new development. It said, Houses for Sale. Last night, everybody, I landed from Dublin, drove home, and the same sign has been changed. It now said, or said last night, Houses Now Selling. And as someone interested in the psychology of influence, it was incredibly interesting. Houses for sale conjures up the image of houses lined up waiting to be sold. But houses now selling, I wonder if it's the same for you, conjures up for me the idea of people going in there and making decisions to buy and signing on the dotted line. Really interesting change based on psychology. The phenomenon of social proof put forward by Robert Cialdini, the American psychologist and influence expert. He purports that we as humans are more likely to make decisions to follow behaviours if other people have already done so. And the more people who've chosen to do so, the better. I wonder if this insight can be used when you're interacting with other people. Now, the words influence and persuasion sometimes get a negative reaction, but the truth is we are all influencing all the time. It might be to get your children to go to bed on time, it might be to sell, it might be a point of view. You know, we are all influencing those we socially interact with. And when you do so, when you're trying to do so effectively, you can use the idea that these housing developers uh, got the insight on too. Just promote to those you're interacting with that other people have already made that decision or followed that behavior. And psychology suggests that those you're interacting with are more likely to do so too. Simple, effective, and based on science. I'll be back in a week's time. Until then, have a great seven days and see you next Thursday. Cheers, bye-bye.